Welcome, in this video, I'm gonna teach you how you can create your first membership site using Value Add-on. The first step is to go ahead and log into your Value Add-on admin account. You can find that link by going to valueaddon.com and clicking on the members login link at the top of the page. Once you're inside, you should be taken to your dashboard that, that should look similar to this. Once you're in your dashboard, click on the button that says, create your first site now. This will take you to a very simple form. Once this form is submitted, you will have a brand new membership site created literally within seconds. It will be hosted, it will come with a shopping cart, a sales page creator, it will allow you to upload all of your media and your training materials, and all that stuff actually happens within seconds after you fill out this form. So let me walk you through how to do that. The first step is to give your site a name. Now, this name will be the name of your membership site, and this will also be the name that your visitors see when they go to this site. Now, you can change any of this information at a later date, so don't get stuck on that. Let's just go ahead and give it a name. So for this example, I'm gonna call it Joshua's Art School. Next, I will need to choose a URL. Now, every value add-on site must have what's called a value add-on subdomain. This is gonna be the URL that people go to in order to view my site, whether it's my sales page or their members area. Now, you can use a custom domain name that you use, but you'll need to configure that later. For right now, we'll need to create a subdomain that will make this site accessible at. So, for this example, I'm gonna choose Joshua's Art School dot value add .com, and the dot value add -on .com part has already been added for you. So once again, if people go to this URL, they will see my membership site. Now, the last thing is I need to put in what's called a site owner contact email address. See, every membership site you create with Value Add-on will have its own and separate login. It's called the site owner login. And when you create a membership site, you put in an email address here, and then the system will automatically send you an email to that email address with your login username and your login password to log into what's called the site owner control panel. So go ahead, put in any email address you want here. Now we do recommend using your email address or if you're building this site for someone else, maybe it's a partner, maybe it's a business, maybe it's a third party, you might want to consider using their email address so this login information goes to their account. Once this form is filled out, go ahead and press create membership site. Now within seconds, we're building an entire website for you using value add-on. And once we go to the next page, your site will be completely done and ready for you to manage, edit, and configure. So let's go ahead and wait for this to wrap up, and then I'll tell you what to do next. Okay, it just wrapped up creating that website. As you can see, it's showing up in our dashboard. Here's the website we just created, Joshua's Art School. Here's the URL where that site is accessible as that. Now, the next step would be to manage this site and configure it even more, doing things as uploading your course content, configuring your pricing options so people can sign up, and publishing your built-in sales page. To do all of that stuff and more, we'll need to click on the Manage Site button. But this at least shows you how to create your first website with Value Add-on. If you wanted to create more sites, you can do so if your plan allows it by go ahead and repeating those steps that we just completed.